been quite a while, <laughs> it seems, um, since I've done a video. Um, so I wanted to do a quick one this morning. Um, or it's actually afternoon. I'm <coughs> I'm out on the West Coast visiting my sister and brother-in-law right now. So <laughs> my sense of time is a little bit off, um, but it's even afternoon out here. So uh, I guess <laughs> it's not not morning by any stretch of my uh, time uh, sense. Um, so um, I'm here in Oregon visiting my sister and brother-in-law. Um, I got here on Friday. It's Monday now. Um, had a pretty easy trip out, although it was long, but I'm still kind of recovering from that. Um, but um, it was it was relatively easy, smooth um, trip out, and um, I'm enjoying it here. The weather is beautiful. Let me see if I can show. It's bright and sunny out, um, and it says it's about or it's supposed to be about um, 74 degrees today, which <coughs> it is <laughs> really nice. I mean, it's kind of on the cusp of the rainy season, so I'm lucking out with the good weather. Um, we went for a little hike yesterday and um, been kind of enjoying it um, as, as much as we can. Um, so um, I'm looking forward to having a nice, quiet, relaxing week with no work, um, which I think will be really good. And hopefully I'll get to sleep as much as I need to and, um, you know, get out and enjoy beautiful weather and and spend some good time with my sister and brother in law. Um and this is um this is friendly bear who um is <laughs> kind of a family member <laughs> here at my brother and sister in law's at uh, my sister and brother in law's house. Um it's it's kinda of funny. He's kind of like their their child right now. <laughs> um but it's really cute. Um so health wise since my last update things have been okay. Um, they haven't really been better, but they haven't really been worse. Um, I've been continuing on with what I've been doing. Um, my arm's getting tired holding up my phone. I've um, been continuing with what I've been doing with the doxycycline and um, actually have not done my pulse of flagell, um kind of when I was supposed to because just one thing after another kind of came up. And um, now that I'm out here, um, part of the reason is actually because we're going to go um, do some wine tasting and stuff, and with Blackwell, you can't have any alcohol. So probably not the best best <laughs> reason health-wise, but like quality of life and having fun wise, it kind of is. Um, so I'm waiting to do that until I get back home. Um, I <laughs> The reason I decided to do a video right now is that I was getting my morning meds ready, my oral stuff, and this is them. That's not even all of them because... Um, for some reason, I don't have all of them here. Um, but and this morning, I am also going to start taking the colloidal silver, which um, I had talked about before. Um, this is um, miso silver that I'm taking, which someone had mentioned in a comment they had heard was a good kind. So I'm a little nervous about starting it, but I've kind of been waiting and waiting and waiting, and it's time to do it. Um, I also did start on the. Um, the mitochondrial transfer factor, um, and I'm up to the full dose now. Um, but it's only been like a week that I've really been doing close to the full dose, so I don't really know if it's helping yet. And then I'll be starting the um, Lyme specific transfer factor probably once things settle down with the um, with the miso silver. So kind of adding those things in. Um, I also found out that I will um, through some really lucky circumstances, I'll be able to get um, probably a limited supply of a newer antibiotic that both of my Lyme doctors have talked to me about and wanted me to try, um, called tigacycline. It's a kind of a newer IV antibiotic in the tetracycline family. Um, so I'm going to be able to get that and I have to call my primary care doctor <coughs> and let her know that I am interested in doing it and set up a time to go and have the first dose in her office um, when I get back. So that's kind of how things are going here, um, and um, you know, hopefully this week will kind of rejuvenate me because I've been a little worn out. Um, I ended up I had jury duty and ended up on a jury, and so for a week and a half I was in court every day, which was okay and it was a good experience overall, but it was more tiring than I thought it would be. Um, and oh, and I've had some interviews at 
a preschool near where I teach my theater classes, which would be really good, and it looks like I'm probably going to be able to get a job there. So it'll cut down on my traveling, because um, I think traveling an hour each way twice a week to teach my theater classes. So it'd be good to not have so much um, so much commuting time. Um, so that's kind of how things are. Um, I'm going to take my medicine here and um, head off over to a little cafe and kind of health food store around the corner and have some coffee and sit and read and then get some baking supplies and make some yummy stuff this afternoon. So um, I'll do another video um, if I have something important to update on or, you know, if I'm just bored and feel like it. So um, hope you're all doing well and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.